loves this is Swain and welcome back to my channel how are you guys today you probably know what we're going to unboxing of my huge huge skincare and makeup haul so to keep it organized I divided them into skincare and makeup and just so you know that most of them are from Sephora but some I got it from Winners or Marshalls as well. They are also mostly holiday kits and limited edition because I mostly bought them during holiday um, from November. That's why I have a huge collection of them and I haven't had a chance to open it. And then I thought like, oh, why not do a video of unboxing them in front of you guys and you'll probably be as excited as I am. And honestly, I do love shopping during holidays because they do have the limited edition holiday releases, like the new launches. And I love trying out minis and travel sizes before I commit to like full size. Also, don't forget that during November, December or literally end of the year, they do have a lot of sales. So you get like the best deals there is. So for my kit, I love buying during those times because I can get really great uh, deals out of it. Also, like I said, this will be unboxing, plainly unboxing and just showing you what's inside. Um, I'm not going to do any swatches or a review of the products. And if you guys want a specific product for me to try on and show you how to use it or do a product review or like a more thorough review, let me know down below the comment section and I can do a separate video for you. So if you want to see what I got, keep on watching and please please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and also the subscribe button down there okay let's get started first up is this holiday heroes by mario badesco um it comes with the cleansing gel and then they have facial spray this is the very popular one i used this one before i start my makeup um, they also have a collagen mask, a silver powder, and a drying lotion. This one is same, almost same with like the Kate Somerville. Um, it is very affordable. I got this on sale, I think just last week. So yeah, it's probably still on sale at Sephora. And I think it's like half the price or like 35 or something like that. It's really, really good to try. Um, it's pretty good brand. And if you want to try something new for like skincare, this is like a really good starting kit. Okay, and then this one, I'm so excited. This is my Valentine gift for myself. This is from PMD. I always wanted to try this, but it's quite expensive. So I was like just looking and checking until... Um, I think it was on sale. Yeah, Valentine's. It got on sale for like, I forgot if it's like half price, but it's a really, really good deal. So I was like, I can't say no to this. Also, they were on sale during December, but it was on my, my cart. And I don't know if I should buy it or not. I was like thinking about it. And then obviously it got sold out right away. So when I saw it again in February, I was like, I have to get it. And I was like thinking of, a good alibi or reason for me to buy it because obviously it's sometimes it's hard for a mom to buy something for herself but since it's valentine's i was like oh might as well treat myself right so it comes with the actual machine so this one is the personal microderm it's a clinical grade exfoliation with vacuum suction so i was planning to do a video of how to use it and my first review or first impression about it so i'm not gonna turn it on or anything just wanted to open the box and show it to you so it has the instructions there of how to use it and what's inside i don't want to blind you guys but yeah i'm so excited because it's also pink i love pink like obviously you can probably tell in my room speaking of that i haven't i haven't had a chance to post um a video of a tour on my makeup room i have I have been getting a lot of requests, so I'll get into that very, very soon for you guys. Okay, next, this is from Laneige. I love, love, love this one. Plus, they launch different um, scents or flavor, um, but this is the original one. This is their Lip Sleeping Mask. It's the strawberry one, like strawberry yogurt. It literally smells like that, and if you taste it, it's kind of like sweet. So from this, they launch um, three other um, shades or colors or scents. Um, the green one is apple lime. This one here is vanilla. And this one is grapefruit. And it also comes with like um, a scoop 
or applicator to apply it on. Okay, also, again, another lip mask or lip balm. I love anything that's like glossy, that's moisturizing for my lips. That's what I've been obsessing about lately. So I also got this one. This was on sale, obviously. This is from Bite. It comes in three different products. Let me just grab it for you guys. So this one is the Agave Lip Therapy. So this is like a travel set. Looks like that. Still have a lid in there. And then it has the Agave Lip Mask in a tube. And then this is also a lip mask, but it's like in a lipstick form. So all of them are travel sizes. And like you said, I love travel sizes. They're just so cute. I can say no to them, especially if they are on sale. But they're also like a really good, um, like a trial set if you haven't tried their products. But by the way, the brand Bite um, is a Canadian brand and they're mostly natural as well. I believe they are in clean beauty in Sephora, which means less um harsh products or ingredients in there so it's really really good and even the lip mask or lip balm are edible so just so you know that's why i love them okay next is choose beauty this is also a clean brand it says here it's an organic solution um, i love this one i don't think it's 100 percent organic um, but it's mostly is organic so it's a pretty good alternative if you're going into more natural brands clean beauty is a really a juice beauty rather sorry it's a really really good one to try um with this set this also got in sale i think it's still on at sephora right now for i believe 42 dollars um from 60 dollars so that's six dollars already a really really good deal so this set comes with a cleansing oil um anti-wrinkle eye treatment uh this one is the anti-wrinkle moisturizer and exfoliating peel like this one i wanted to do a review as well because especially the peel spray is really good product and it's amazing i want to show you how cool it is so I'm probably going to do a review once i get into this one right now for skincare if you're wondering what i'm using i'm mostly using um, a Glucifer collection brand and it's been good for my skin so after I'm done with that I'm going to try either the Mario Badescu or the Juice Beauty okay next is this one here this is from Caudalie this is their three pack of hand and nail cream um, this one is $24 it comes this is the original one so they have this one I'm not sure if they have the scent down here but I, I really, really love this one of all the hand creams that I've tried. This one is not sticky at all. It dries pretty quickly. It, it's very moisturizing. And the ingredients of Caudalie are pretty good. They are more on the clean beauty um, list in Sephora. So yeah, you probably want to try this one. I have the full size, but whenever it's holiday, I get like the travel sizes because it's really great for you guys to put it on your purse and in your um, in your car. So especially in the winter, we all need the hand cream that we can get. And these are very good. And also the scent, it's not too overpowering. There are some hand creams that I've tried and I cannot take the scent. It's just too, it's too much. It gives me headache but this one is one of those great brands that i would love to have it in my my purse every time so yeah that's codely next up is the josie moran this is the argan oil um this one i didn't get it from sephora i got it from winners and it's a pretty good deal you can probably see that red tag there so this one is originally 64 dollars for the full size um, I got it for $12. Yes, you heard it right. It's $12. So how can I say no to that? So obviously I got two. There's there's two of them there. So I was like, I need to grab both of them. So I personally don't use this one, but I use it for clients because I have oily combination skin. But I love using this one for um, dry, patchy skin. 
and like more mature skin clients because it's really moisturizing and it's more natural well it's this one is 100 pure argan oil so it is amazing um you probably see some argan oil out there in the market and you can probably say that oh this is like way cheaper than that josie moran but they are not 100% argan oil. He would just say it's argan oil, but if you check the ingredient list, you will see there how much or how many percentage is the argan oil in there. So you have to um, keep it in mind. But this one is amazing. It's 100% argan oil. And um, the founder or the CEO of the brand um, is beautiful inside and out. So yeah, go check them out. And I think this is the last one for skincare. This one is this one is from Sephora. Probably renew the plastic here. But this is their what do you call this face and body massage set. So it looks like um, suction cups. Because it's literally are like suction cups. So it's like silicone, I believe, made of silicone. It has three different sizes. So you can use it for your face and for your body. Um, I'm just gonna show you how how it looks like close up. So this is the second size or second to the smallest. This is their big, bigger, biggest one. And then this is the smaller one. So you can use them on um, body and face. And I forget exactly what's the name of that facial that they use like suction cups, but you can probably check it out and see, but I've seen like really good reviews on this one and that kind of facial it kind of help lips up your face and you know like cellulites and stuff like that so i wanted to try it and it's from sephora so i was like why not i got their um um crystal rollers as well like the rose quartz and i forget the whole set but i already opened it so i didn't show it to you guys but i also got that one and i'm obsessed with it i was so excited so that's one of the products that I have to open right away. But yeah, this one is also part of their new releases on skincare from Sephora Collection. So please check them out. They are amazing. And the brand is understated, um, but it is really, really good. The quality is really good. And it's comparable to other higher brands in Sephora. So that's the end for my skincare haul. Okay, my loves, now we're moving to palettes. Okay, so first, I got the James Charles palette. Everyone's raving about this one. It is so, so good. Um, very colorful. People who love colorful eyeshadow, this is the one for you guys. This is from Morphe brand. And Morphe is known for really high and really high quality um, eyeshadows and products, but at very low cost. Especially their brushes and eyeshadows, they are my favorite so i'll show you this one this one is the james charles and you'll see how beautiful the colors are look at that and it's very very pigmented i'm not gonna swatch it i haven't really <laughs> played with it you can tell that it's brand new you still have this plastic there um but usually when i adore an eyeshadow palette i don't usually use it right away unless there's a look that I would need those color in that palette, then I would have to use it. But I make sure that I'll take a picture first, so I haven't, so I'm not gonna swatch it for you guys for now. Sorry about that. But I can make a video um, and do a makeup look out of this palette, okay? All right, and then, next up, this one is from Sephora Collection. This is their Sephora Pro. Uh, Pro Pigment Palette. This is their Editorial 2.0. I got the Editorial, the first one, um, last year, I believe. And then they launched this one. So I was like, I need to get it. Um, they were on sale just a month ago, I believe, for like half the price. This is like $85 and it's down to 40 something. So I really, really need to get it. Um, I don't usually use... Um, this kind of colors but I feel like I'll be able to use it someday somehow depending on the client's look that they wanted or if I'm into those these colors but I I feel like they are really really good um, based on the other palettes I got from the Sephora Pro 
um, collection. Um, highly pigmented, it applies really well. Um, the color payoff is amazing, so I know that I need to get it. So this is, these are the colors. Let me zoom it to you guys. So obviously it's a mixture of um, matte um, shimmer and there are like loose, um, not loose, pressed pigment there. Um, so it, yeah, if you want me to do a product review on this, let me know. But that's what we're gonna do for now. And then another Sephora Pro pigment palette is this one, and this is the cool version. I'm going to show you guys. Just open it quickly for you. Okay, and it looks like that. I love their packaging. It's just very pro. Um, well, the ones who made or collaborated with Sephora collection are like Sephora professional makeup artists, like a team of them, and made this one like the formula and like the colors to put in the palette. So you know for sure that they are really, really good um, product or quality. So I'm going to open this. This is the cool. So you'll see this one is amazing and perfect for those um, light to fair um, skin tone. You would work really well on your guys' skin tone. Um, so yeah, if you're thinking of getting a palette that's like really good quality, then this one is amazing for that. And yeah, like I said, like the cool palette is perfect for light and fair skin tone. Okay. Next is this one from Too Faced. Look at that. It's so cute. Like the packaging is amazing. I just love anything that's like glittery, shimmery. I'm that kind of girl. Yeah, all that shimmer or all that like bling. I love it. So this is their Too Faced Then and Now Eyeshadow Palette. So at the back, you'll see the colors that's in there. So it's just showing like the, I think this is their first eyeshadow palette palette the 1998 the first launch i'm not sure but it says the 1988 and this one is the 2018 um colors that kind of like match the colors from the 1998 so it's pretty cool so i'll show you how it looks like inside and the packaging of the palette again is so nice i'm not really sure if i'll be able to use it but i know that i'm going to have it displayed in my makeup room that's why i bought it that's basically mainly the reason why i bought it yeah i know i'm guilty but this one got on sale i've been thinking of buying it and then i was like i don't think i'll use the colors or i have them already on my hundred other palettes that's sitting in my room but i was like what it's on sale i need to get it now then okay so that's that's how it looked like inside and those are the colors very very pretty so again there's a um, combination of the finishes, their matte, shimmer, um, pressed pigment in there. Um, and I really like the quality of Too Faced um, palettes, especially their eyeshadow. So I know that this is going to be a very good um, quality palette. But yeah, this is amazing for like gifts as well. But this is limited edition, guys. So unfortunately, they're not available anymore. But if you find them somewhere, somehow, and if you really want it, like, this one is amazing. Okay. Okay. Next will be from Becca. Good eye. I hope I'm not blinding you guys. But I love the packaging. This is like rose gold. I think they're rose gold. Well, it's more golden and this is the rose gold. Or like pink gold. Or something like that but i love their packaging i love anything that's like rose gold just so you know guys and like gold obviously but i have two of them one is for um light to medium skin tone and the other one is medium to deeper skin tone so obviously this is not for me this will be for my kit for my clients so i'm going to show you how it looks like this is the light to medium so i'm just going to show you this one here because they're basically almost similar the other one is just a bit uh darker colors so it works better for uh deeper skin tones 
Um, so this is how it looks like. It's really nice and slick. Um, it has like um, the names of the product or what it is, what are they used for. Um, so when you open it, there's a mirror. Pretty sure, yeah, there's a mirror there. And then this one is the, um, I believe that's, it's the brightening powder. Sorry, I used to blind you. Then this, no, this is the blur powder. This is the brighten powder or their like highlight highlighter. And then this is the blush. And then this is the contour. So I, what I love about this uh, palette, it is good for like your full face. You just need this palette and that's everything you need. So if you're traveling, this is very ideal. You don't have to bring 20 other items on your makeup kit or your makeup bag because you already have like a setting a setting powder or like the blur powder is what they call and then for bronzing or contouring you have this one and then the one on top is a blush and what i love about the blush is it is um very glowy so just so you know that becca is all about the glow um that's one thing that i really love about becca is just it's it always have that glow in their products so it's not just like a dull look like all matte all dull or anything like that but i love love becca and then this one is their highlighter and speaking of highlighter becca is really known for their um champagne pop oh my goodness i almost forgot champagne pop highlighter everyone loves it um, it's a very very creamy it it shows right away it'll goes a long way and if you want to be like a blinding highlighter that's the one you want to go for okay and then this one is also from becca uh, this is a limited edition from um collaboration with chloe and her bff malika i'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it but sorry if it's wrong but yeah chloe and malika and this one is their becca bffs bronze blush and glow palette I'll show you how it looks like inside okay so another golden um, packaging so the back um, it says the soft focus highlighter the radiant blush and then another radiant blush and satin matte bronzer so the soft focus highlighter is the one over here that's the bronzer there um, sorry, I don't want to be blinding you guys. And there's two different shades for blushes. One is pitchy, the other one is more like on the pinker, rosy side. So yeah, this is also very beautiful. As you can see, the blushes are, again, glowy or it has like a nice uh, sheen to it. It almost have like a built-in highlighter that's more um, subtle. So yeah, this is another perfect one if you are traveling it's a complete face palette okay next one is from vice art i always always wanted to buy a pot from vice art hopefully i'm saying it right um uh but they are quite pricey like pat mcgrath um, natasha denona i believe they are about of the same range um in terms of quality and the price as well but this one got on sale so obviously i have to grab that opportunity but this is how it looks like and i love this one this one is the uh, warm edit it has 12 different shades in here and they are known for the quality which means it is highly pigmented um, a little goes a long way and all the pros are using it like i think like the one on editorial or something like that but um i was so excited when i saw it on sale and i was like i, I really have to grab it um, so this is how it looks like inside it's just a little palette but I'm pretty sure it's tiny but mighty look at the colors though they are so beautiful right look at that um, this one reminds me of sunset I believe I have something similar to this but I know that I would love this one um, the size is perfect if I'm traveling or if I want more space for my kit I can easily bring this one and these are the colors that um, normally clients would request so yeah this is very ideal for me and also for like summer I love the color for sure this will be a really beautiful for summer or spring so so happy I got this one okay 
I think this is the last one for the palettes. Uh, this one is the Natasha Denona. Natasha, who, okay, is it showing? There we go. It's the Natasha Denona uh, Mini Lila, Lila palette. It's a five eyeshadow palette. I'll show you the colors. I think these are like the purple ones. Um, this got on sale as well, so yeah. You probably know. <laughs> Not all of them are on sale, but it's either on sale or limited edition. That's why I grabbed them. But yeah, just so you, you guys can see what you can get during holiday season. Um, this is how it looks like. It is so beautiful, highly pigmented. Natasha Denona is another brand that I adore because of the quality. Um, purples, they are hard to find. You can probably find purples, but there are some. There are purples here that I've been looking for, but I cannot find on my other palettes. So I was like, I need, I need to get this one. So yeah, there are mainly purples and then a neutral color and like a shimmer gold over there. So pretty. So that's it for the palettes. I think I'm going to move on with the winner um, finds winners slash marshalls i think in us they call it tjx um so here we call it either marshalls or uh, winners but these are my really good steal of a deal products okay i'll start with this one this one is from makeup forever um i think i got it for i don't know if it's 20 dollars or something but this this one both of them are full sizes of setting powder one is the loose um hd um powder or high definition powder it's still sealed I haven't used it but i love this one it's really nice for setting your makeup and same as with this one over here but it is in pressed form so this both of them are translucent which means once you set it you set your makeup um it won't Oops. it won't change the color of your foundation it will just seal your whole makeup in place so yeah i really love this one and finding this on win uh, winners for that price i really have to get them okay next are i guess lip products this one is from anastasia or anastasia um, this is their matte lipstick set there is six of them here uh, these are the color i'm not gonna show the color i'm sorry i don't want you guys to watch this for an hour i don't know if you guys wanted to do that but i can do a separate video for that for swatching but over here you can see the colors um the names are plumeria dusty mauve that's my one of my favorite shades ruby latte peachy and brandy so these are all matte lipstick i believe this yeah it is a travel size or yeah travel size or deluxe size but yeah it just looks like that there next one is again from anastasia well i forget to show you the price of this one this one says its regular price is 40 and then I got it for 20, so half the price. But usually what they say on the original price is lower than it actually is. So you are even, you're getting even better deal from it. Okay, again from Anastasia, this one is the lip gloss set. Look at those colors. They are so beautiful. You can use it by itself or uh, as a lip topper. These are all the name of the colors. So diamond, citrine, pearl, and pink tourmaline. So again, anything that is gloss, I love them. I've been loving them, especially in the winter. I guess because our lips get tends to get so, so dry. So anything that looks so moisturizing are like my looks right now. Okay. Another one here is from Marc Jacobs. This one, I have this um, specific set in my cart at Sephora.ca. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna buy it or something or like on my wish list, I think. And then one day I went to Winners and I saw this exact same um, set for only $14.99. It says $30 is the original. I'm pretty sure it's more than that in Sephora. Um, but I, I saw this one. I was like, oh my goodness, I should get it because it's the same exact one but cheaper. So those are the colors. Um, these are the shades. It's the Night Moves move moves movie um plum get it and burn notice 
so really really good this one is uh, it's called the three piece travel size limark liquid lip crayon set so it's a lip crayon but oh my goodness i actually swatched it the other day because i was like huh, i wonder how it actually applies if it's like the nars one and it's pretty similar to nars um i love the the nars crayon um lipstick because they last like a very long time and um, the only difference i would say is the one that the one that i've tried from nars are matte i believe they have the one that is like creamy like this but this one is like really creamy it is like butter when you apply it on it is amazing very pigmented a little goes a long way and for the price that i got i felt like i'm a winner for sure okay and then another one for lips is this kevin aquan kevin aquan is another brand that i love 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 um it's also on the higher end uh brand but um their quality is amazing this is also a lip gloss um it's called the molten lip color mini collection it says original price is 32 and it's down to 19.99 um i didn't see this specific set in at sephora so it's probably at cabin Quine website um but they're all glosses there's um five of them and it said all glosses i love either i use it for myself or for my kit for my clients so i'm still getting a really good deal out of them okay next one next one is from becca so i'm going to show you both of them i got these two from winners i've been eyeing these two at sephora and i think they went on sale but then it ran out right away obviously um these are holiday sets i believe and oops um and i got it from winners when i started from winners i was like oh my gosh that's what i've been wanting to buy but been thinking forever so they sold out um but the good thing is we're really meant to be because i got them for even cheaper than the sale at sephora uh this set here is 14.99 it has the four travel uh set of lip glosses um it's called becca uh, this is the collaboration with chrissy tegan um chrissy cravings lip icing glow gloss kit um they are all like shimmery i believe except for um the red here but it is a gloss so it will be it will have that shim to it and then this one here is another one from becca and i got it for 24.99 there we go and original price is 35 a little bit more than that um but yeah this is another uh, collaboration with creasy it comes with uh, it's called the glow kitchen kit and it comes with let me see here um lip sofa in red velvet glow sofa eyeshadow and highlighter duo and cinnamon churro it is a two-in-one duo featuring a lux shimmer eyeshadow and an ultra sensorial creamy highlighter so it's pretty cool that's the one over here and then the last one is the confectionery glow powder and cinnamon sugar so just like a loose powder highlighter over here on the top so everything is like glowy um, and I love the color of the gloss as well. Very neutral. I feel like any skin tone um, would love this one. It will work with any skin tone and would look really, really good. Okay, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy watching and I'll see you on the next one. See you, my loves.